on Marlon TV and Scoots. We're deep into the season. It's been quite some time since you and I have uh, sat side by side in the comms box. Yeah, rehab can be a killer, but it's good to be back. Well, it's great to have you back, mate. And, uh, well, Manly look, uh, look Ooh, dangerous Munz. here. There's the Munns, wide ball. That's onto the, uh, that's Siali in and away. Geez, the little fella. That's a great carry. That's 40 metres upfield, lays it back. And there's Seymour on the spot. Yeah, Louis, uh, he's electric at the moment. It's good to have him back, the little fella, buzzing around. Likewise, this little fella, Chris Coddy, and that's uh, out to Darcy, on to Sig, Big brought Sig. down. Big Sig, bad body height. Out to Smith. There's the Wallaby Centurion offload. Oh, oh, oh. His Wallaby teammate, Lekepa, over the top to Brahm. Oh, this is razzle-dazzle from the Marlins. Scoots. All I can say is it's good to have you back, boys. Where have you been for the last f three or four weeks? Yeah, we have not seen enterprising play like this in quite some time. Coddy again out to Seymour, the debutante. Wide, long ball to seek the racehorse. Pumps oh, the legs. Oh, that is brilliant. Back of the hand. Darcy over. Well, 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 Scoots. It's been a long break, but that must warm the cockles of your little rumfield heart. <laughs> it sure does. Luckily, Lekep has cut that throw. Otherwise, that ball could still be stuck in there somewhere. Up, well, Scoots, the Marlins trying to get the season back on track here at Foreshore this afternoon. They lead 5-3 and uh, enjoy some fairly handy field posse here too. I think it was Roosevelt said, it starts and ends up front. And uh, we're getting a very good picture of that right here. There's Fairbrother driving the scrum forward and Wycliffe Palu makes a mockery of Zach Mullane's attempt to tackle. That is a stuff of nightmares for fly halves everywhere, Scoots. I think his brother's outlaw on gladiators. He needed to channel some of his uh, energy and aggression to stop the big show then. Dare I say it would not have helped. So it's the Marlins leading now 12-3. The downfield kick there from Darcy finds the Rebels winger who returns with a bit of interest, Scoots, and there's plenty of interest in how the Marlins can uh, progress in this late end of the Ooh, season. That's, that's a, charged down. That's an They're awful kick from Coddy, but it's gone straight to the hands of Siali, who's found Seymour onto the Munns. The big bird, he's away up the guts. He's found Bot brought down. Oh, what a pass by Bot. That was phenomenal stuff. Yes, yeah, sneaky little pass there from Lightning Leon. They're really pressing forward here. Seattle oh, to repeat. <laughs> the little buzzy bee He's over. And uh, repeat carries from Seattle. And one of them results in another five-pointer. And the Marlins cruising here. Gee, the addition of uh, Tim Fairbrother to this front row. The former Wellington Hurricane scoots. It has paid huge dividends already. I feel a bit sorry for the guy who woke up this morning and thought I'm packing against Fairbrother. He's got Wallaby written all over him. Speaking of Wallabies, there's Palu. Offloads to Cotty. Simple numbers game. Siali in the corner. Put down the glasses. Yeah, that was just too easy, Scoots. Plenty of room down that blind side. And Siali, that's, that's his second. That's his second, yeah. Welcome back, Louis. Well, any doubts about the trip south uh, from Manly have been dispelled with a, uh, with a bit of an exclamation point this afternoon, McGee. And, uh, you know, Eddie Alloy sent me an email through the week. Jeez, it was inspiring stuff. I yeah. knew we had a performance like this. Well, in I'm a... surprised he could actually work a computer, Scoots. But that's a story for another day. There's Palu. He has been impressive today. The big Wallaby number eight. Look at him just standing, oh. anchoring them all. Bram. That's Bram. Oh, Melrose. Ryan Melrose, the offload to the angry little land. Chris Cotty, welcome back. What a performance, Scoots McGee. Welcome back, Cotty, as they say. Yeah, uh, <laughs> yep, nice little finish there, mate. Terrible uh, pun. Terrible pun, but uh, you're back to rehab. It's been a great little break, and it looks as though the Marlins are back doing what they do best, winning football games. Deep in the shadows in the Shire, Shawnee. It's wonderful to be here. Can't wait to get over the Captain Cook Bridge and get back to Mantown. Well, mate, I'm going to stop in at the Tarrant Point Inn for a quick one. You won't be joining me, but I will be joining you next week at Manly Oval for the Norse Clash. We'll see you then.